Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to define supplementary angles. Now, with supplementary angles, they're very important in uh, geometry-related concepts and courses, as along with trigonometry, and you might also use them in other math courses that you may not expect. But the important thing to talk about when it comes to supplementary angles is the significant number of 180 degrees. Because when we're talking about supplementary angles, we're talking about angles that add to give you 180 degrees. Now, generally, the context is two angles, even though you could have more than two. But the simplest way to think about supplementary angles is that of a straight line. Because a straight line is an 180 degree angle. Now, if you were to split the straight line into two pieces, you'll have created two angles that are guaranteed to give you 180 degrees. And the two angles are called supplements. Now, suppose this particular angle, as you can tell, is greater than 90. Let's just say this is 120 degrees. We're asked to find out then what is the measure of its supplement. All you need to do is take 180 minus 120, and that'll give you 60. And so the missing measure is going to be 60 degrees. Now, if you have another example, take a straight line and divvy it up into two pieces. Suppose this was 30 degrees, and you want to find out the missing angle here. Again, just take 180 minus 30, and that'll give you 150. And so the missing angle, or the supplement, is 150 degrees. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's a brief introduction on defining supplementary angles.